In this video I will show you how to organize your mods with the mod organizer. The first thing you need to do is open your mod folder that you can find within your game directory. A couple of things to know before you start. In the left here you see a version number. This number should always be set to the version that your game is currently running at. This way your mods will always work properly, otherwise uh, they might be disabled by the game itself. For the load order, um, the load order means that load order 0 will always be loaded before load order 1 for example. So if there are conflicts, load order 1 will win the conflict of load order 0. So you want to move the mods that you want to load first. Uh, at the bottom and mods that you want to load after and have more priority you want to load them in the back. Now if we want to start organizing our mods it's very easy all we have to do is click and drag mods to where we want to place them. The application will automatically organize your load order and it will tell you that you need to save your changes uh, for them to take effect. You can also select multiple mods at once if I select um, all these mods, I can move them uh, in order and the application will automatically change them. And thus again, for uh, saving your changes, you have to deploy them. Of course, sometimes you might make a mistake and then you want to undo them by pressing the undo button. If you want to revert the load order of your mod back to its default load order, you can do so by selecting your mod and then pressing the reset to defaults button. Yet another clan Mac has a default load order of 0, but as you can see it has been put on 1. This is because compatibility pack also occupies load order 0, and if that's the case then the application will organize the mods by alphabetical order. This is all you have to know about organizing your load order. Just remember that every change you make, you need to deploy for your changes to take effect. 